Well, we beat Terra, the beast. And we actually have a way out of it as well. Ah, the boss, you haul! Is it not for the ghastly machine, the tram? I hope you're not thinking of riding on that grotesque contra... Contrapassion? Contra... I don't know what that means. I thought a man mechanic machine could attempt what the stags do. Foolish, very <sighs> foolish. Come on, man. I just want to take the train to enter a new area. That's all I want to do. <laughs> Hi do Skull and welcome back to another Hollow Knight video. And in today's video, we are gonna do a lot, but it's gonna be a lot of exploring. It's not gonna be as much of actually accomplishing anything, if I'm gonna be completely honest. <laughs> we are first gonna head off over to the resting grounds, and we're gonna talk to C, see if she can give us some cool rewards for what we've been doing so far. Or if she's just gonna be annoying and just leave us behind, you know? Uh, there's only one way to find out. <laughs> After that, we're heading over to the Broken Crossroads once again. And, uh, well, there will be a little bit of twist over there. So let's just enter the video and let's have some fun. I don't remember. Hello, say. Ah, Wilder, you've returned. Let me, let me have a look at that dream nail. Hmm, you already collected 100 essence? Quick work! Things come naturally to you, don't they? No wonder the dreamers tried to bury you in the old dream. Perhaps you frightened them. Or perhaps, being prisoners themselves, they desired your company. In any case, you still have a long way to go. Take this old trinket as encouragement for me, and return when you have collected 200 essences. Hell What do you mean, trinket? <laughs> it's just a hand on the seal, I have a lot of them. <laughs> ah, your dream they holds over 200 essences. You're proving your talent in its collection. Have you seen the great door just outside? My tribe closed it long, long ago and forbade its opening. Ah, but as far as I can tell, I'm the only member of my tribe, still breathing. D d that means I needn't feel bad about breaking a taboo. As proof of my belief in you, I'll open the door. Alright. There, the door is open, and you can enter the glad beyond it. Listen closely, in there, you may hear the uttering of bugs long gone. Wait, actually. Is there anything more that you want to say? So, you've collected 300 essences, yes? Ah, oh, 500 essences! You're a master in the making, well done, well done! I have a small reward for you. Plucked from one of my most precious memories, this charm will bring you and the dream nail closer. Together, still. The secrets of this kingdom won't be able to hide from you any longer. Take it and return once you have collected 700 essences. More gifts awaits you! The dream wielder. Oops. Transient charm, created for those who wield the dream nail and collect essence, allows the bearer to shard the dream life faster, and collect more soul when striking foes. Wait, can you? I mean, why would I ever use this as a, as a, like, you know, as a damaging skill, you know? It, it's not really the fastest attack. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, but she actually opened up the door, she wasn't lying to me. So she said, be wary because you might hear the dead people, basically. Spirit's Glade. Ah, it's a warrior. The bugs within this glade are under my watch. Treat them with respect and you may remain. But raise your nail and you'll contend with me. Alright, I raise my nail. Oh, you actually wasn't lying. You see, I don't feel like this is fair. <laughs> oh god, there's a lot of souls here. Buy my cookies! They're ever so tasty! <laughs> okay! Beware your own mind, little one. Twisted minds be dark deeds, and mine was more twisted than most. I thought it would be my end, but instead I found this glade and with its sort of peace. Alrighty. Maybe I'm not actually supposed to beat that dude. I used to keep others. They were brought to me sick and dying. What difference did it make? And a victory against death will always be temporary. Fair. Don't fear, little creature! Though a violent rage once possessed me, the peaceful air in this place seems to keep it at bay. You look absolutely badass, by the way. 
Hey. Are you a warrior, little one? A true warrior is one who can stand strong in the midst of the storm. No, I'm a warrior if you ever seen one. I once was obsessed with power, though my time within this glade has shed me for such desire. What folly it was to ever crave such ambitious thing. Fair? Did I talk to you? Yeah, I did. Alright. What is up here then? Like the father of Conifer. We're left. We're always left with reminders of the errors we've made. Let your mistakes not burden you, but serve as guideposts on where not to travel. That is definitely the father of Conifer. Oh god. Do you like my day, little wanderer? I carry only three. Far less the legends may suggest. Still, each is sharper than the last, and I'd require only one to cut you down. Hundred Nail. That's, that's a nice title. Are you admiring my fabulous markings? I'm of a distinguished species, you see. Though I've not seen another like me for the longest time. Interesting. Quite interesting. This is definitely like... This is the definition of a cemetery. I can see all the spirits. Are you enjoying your time in the glade? I'd offer advice. Though you have made it here, you're obviously quite adept at navigating our world and its perils. What? Oh god. Why does this one freak me out the most? Don't fear my rotting form, though my body sheds and changes, my core remains the same. That's terrifying. Oh, Jesus! All of life's problem can be solved with crushing force. Such a simple mantra, and one I've always lived by. If you weren't so scrawny, I'd suggest you follow my example. Are you saying that I doesn't look strong? <laughs> Don't judge me by appearance. Though my stature is small, I bear a dark soul and a tendency to go berserk in battle. I don't believe you. Hark, fellow adventurer, are you heading out in this world? I joined you. But it's been so long, I fear I'd lose my head. Yeah. Yeah, you, you have indeed lost your head. There's so many new voices I need to make. Watch out! I'm an addictive touch. I wouldn't want you getting burned. It's a protection system of my kind. Though something of a nuisance when it comes to meeting others. I'll see you soon, she said. Though that was long ago. I wonder where she went. A wanderer. I've been many places and done a great many things, but I suspect you will outdo me by far. I've long ceased traveling the caverns of Alonis than I suggest, and I suspect they're now far more dangerous than me in my journey. Though with your capable air, I'm sure you'll do fine. Good luck, it's a vast world out there. I came from far to reach this place, though my shell may seem foreign. Beneath it I am a bug, the same as you. His name was a boss, like straight up boss. What a name. Oh. Ah. Ah! I'm a secret finder. <laughs> this has something to do with the dream nail. King's idol. What may you be? Oh, it's another. Of course it is. Alright, a white idol despite in the king of hallowness. The elusive king was worshipped through these idols. Yep, yeah. mm, alrighty. I actually thought there was gonna be something cool here because I found a secret, but no! It's just gonna be another disappointment. <laughs> Interesting. I guess I spoke to every soul. I wonder if you actually can beat this dude, though. Also, I also remember that I can break this. Uh, I don't have any energy. I don't have any focus now. I don't have any soul now. But if I can find some soul real quickly, I can. Uh, I can enter that. 
I can't comprehend that I've already taken down one of the one of the three gods. I can't take it down, you know? Like I, I just can't I can't comprehend it. That it actually happened. <laughs> it was quite the fight though. I really enjoyed it. Um Interesting. I'm at legit 1 HP. What are you? Well, whatever you are, you seem to be a feisty little one! I wonder how many hits this dude needs to do on me to kill me. Oh, actually, it was super easy to kill. Interesting. I have no idea where I am. I can obviously hear a grub far, far away back. And this only leads out. Oh, wait. Oh! Okay, so that, that's just like another way of... Okay, that's just another way of getting, getting to that elevator. Uh, I need to figure out if there was a secret way somewhere. Because I can clearly hear a grub. I can't break that, can't break that. I can break this though. Alright. How fast are you? Okay. You don't charge that far. That's good to know. Let's heal up before we keep on fighting. Because once again, I don't know how much damage they do. I can break this one and then jump upwards. Ah, uh, it might not have been a grub that I heard. It might have been, uh, might have been a bat. No, there was a grub. There's a grub here as well. They deal at least two. I'm a little bit unsure if I had three HP or two HP, but they deal a lot of damage. They deal two. Two eight. So it's not that bad. It's like most of the most of the bigger enemies. Oh, down there is where my soul is. Thank you, little grubby. I've saved many of your kind. Here you are, little soul. Thank you for holding my pebbles. Oh, there's a chest here. With a lot of pebbles. Oh, was that it? Was it just a pebble grab? Oh, wait. Never mind. Glad I'm using my eyes. <laughs> right, where am I going? Jesus, no, no, no more secrets. Come on, why do you have to do this to me? Oh god. And there's another one. Come on! <laughs> it's not okay. Jesus. Oh, inspect. One, uh, Jesus, another wondrous journal. Of course. Of course, they wouldn't just make a secret area like this and actually give something like super good, huh? Never mind. <laughs> um, soul eater. What is soul eater? Forgotten shaman artifact used to draw soul from still living creatures. Greatly increases the amount of soul gained when striking an enemy with a nail. It costs four notches, though. That's a lot of notches. But it also sounds like quite the OP skill to use. Let me rest. I didn't actually know that I could... I didn't actually know that I could strike these guys. But do I gain anything by striking them? Doesn't look like it. Because that would be kind of cool. If I could, like actually could wake them up by striking them with my Dream Nail. Alright, so... We are here in the City of Tears, and we are in the connector between the two areas. So, I thought to myself, uh, while I was just farming around, if I break something, you know, with my melee punch, let's see if I have something I can break. If I break something, you know, I get kind of a, like, a push upwards. I always thought that I might need something like a double jump to get up here, because I've seen in the trailer that there is a double jump, so I always expected there to be a double jump to get myself up here, but what if I can just use this thing that I'm standing on right now? Like, can I just do that? And then, like, wall climb? Like, you can see, I I almost reach it. That might be how to get up there, and I've just completely neglected that. I just completely forgot about the fact that when I break something, I get a push upwards. Yeah. Oh my god, that was so easy. I always thought that was gonna be super hard to do. Wow. I'm generally shocked that it was that easy, to be honest. Because now we actually made our way through here. 
which might be the way to get to the to get to the next streamer for all I know. I mean I've nothing to go after except for this tunnel. So this might be it, and I just never thought about it. Like I'm generally shocked that I never tried it. <laughs> you know? <laughs> I don't know. Also, I switched to my farming setup. I, this is what I like to farm with, you know, gathering swarm. Dash monster because that's my favorite perk without doubt. Not perk, charm. Favorite charm without doubt. And um, I love the no long nail as well. It's super nice. Jesus, I didn't mean to fall down. <laughs> that's fine. That is not fine though. This is not fine at all. Jesus. Mistakes has been horribly made. Oh, mistakes has been made. Why did you... Can you just please bugger off? <laughs> You're the annoying one. These knights are pretty straightforward. As long as I can bounce on the head like that, I mean, we're good to go. So. Oh, it's gonna hurt. It didn't actually strike forward there for once. That's good. Alright, there we go. Now we can open up this. Which opens up what door? Oh yeah, it was the door up here, wasn't it? Nope, that was not the door that it opened. Interesting. Well, there's a bench over here. So let's go and take this bench here. There we go. Now we can also see how this area looks like. Oh my god, of course. Of course this is it. It makes perfect sense. God damn. Why did I never try to bounce on the... Why did I never try to bounce on it? I don't get it. A little bit too much to keep track of. Yep. Of course. Why ain't that awkward? Oh my god, I'm getting my butt kicked. I'm getting my butt kicked by easy monsters. <laughs> did I open this door? Yeah, I did. Okay, so this was the door that I opened. Alright. As long as I know what door I open, you know, I can actually make progress. Sorry, man. <laughs> I'll still have to fall. Just to make sure that we don't die. We do have a lot of pebbles that we definitely need to keep in mind. Wait, can I jump up here? No, I cannot. Okay. Good to know. Oh, this was just a, this was just a this was just a big dude, not a knight. So we're good to go. <laughs> uh, let's go up on the left side here. Smack that lever. And this is our way up. Uh, that leads forward. All right. All right. Let's get up. Brava! I just got here, and you're already mad at me. Come on, mate. Oh, interesting. This dude is gonna be a problem. Yeah, this is gonna be a problem. Because that's the only strategy I know how to beat these guys. There's a bounce on the head. Okay, I can actually do this. It's barely, but I can. I cannot go for two slashes though. I need to only go for one. No greedy play C. Yeah, one and then dash. Oh, my oh god. He looked, up, he looked up way too quickly there. <laughs> Alright. So I know this bridge right here is uh, leading all the way over here. Which is another path to connect the areas, because I already know about this. Oh god. Don't you dare! <laughs> Let's heal up. And there we go. We are getting back all the HP that we once lost. Hmm, I see. This is one that this is one that got triggered as soon as I entered the area. <laughs> yeah, it is. All right, that's another way up. Alrighty. So the elevator, it is. Oh god, it actually went up quite far. This one keeps just going upwards. Oh god, I got super silent over here. Oh, I don't like the silence. Oh, it's just a night, eh? Hey? Nope! There's not just that knight. No, please, please die, please die, please die. Thank you. I don't wanna fight them both together. I just wanna beat those flying girls super quickly because they are quite annoying. 
Especially the spear throwers, they are the worst. I'm just gonna get past him there. Oh, that was, oh, that was dumb. Why did I, why did I dash straight down? That wasn't planned. <laughs> there we go. Hello, Grubby. Yes, I'm here to save you as always. <laughs> I love saving the grubs. It feels so great saving them. I'm constantly on 3 HP, which I definitely am not a big fan of. But it's not a lot I can do about it. Okay, it does not go upwards. What are you? And how much damage are you guys gonna do? I mean, these guys are obviously gonna wake up. I can, I know that for sure. But they're gonna wake up one by one. Okay, I think they're just gonna wake up one by one. Now, now how do I beat these dudes though? Oh Jesus! Oh Jesus! Oh, okay, they have a have a really long roll. They have a really long reach. No, why do you have an ability like that? Dang it! Oh, that's gonna be a, that's gonna be annoying. Two of them woke up at once, of course. And of course they do different attacks. Uh, this is gonna be a problem. Thank you for both doing the same attack there, though. No, oh, oh god, I'm solo. Yeah, I'm dead. Hmm. These guys are gonna be tough. Alright, we're gonna try Fluke Nest and we're gonna try Shaman Stone. Those are gonna be my only perks I'm gonna try. This might be a horrible ID for all I know, but it's an ID that I have. It's been a while since I didn't run Dash Monster. This feels extremely slow. I definitely want to give it a go. Here we go, take some damage! I don't know if this actually was a good idea. <laughs> Take some flukes. I'm doing. I'm doing fine. I'm doing fine. Oh god, no! I j don't go greedy, Sky. Don't go greedy. It is never the time to go greedy. Keep that in mind. We actually beat one. The game really wants me to be up against two. I can tell. Oh god, that was bad. Oh god, that was really bad. I don't know which one is which now. Oh god, as long as they do the roll one and not the bounce one. I feel a little bit more, yeah, I feel a little bit, bit more comfortable with the rolling one. Oh Jesus, he actually hit me with his body there. Oh, this is a problem. Oh, this is a massive problem. I actually killed one of them, alright. Oh, I almost hit that dude. How many of you are you? Alright. This is too much, yeah. <laughs> Alright, what if we get rid of the fluke nest? And then we take spell, spell twister. And yeah, sure, let's go Thorns of Agony. Alright, let's try to go something that is very magic based, but at the same time it's based on me taking damage. Because these guys, I, I feel like these guys are gonna be a problem. Should be fine. Alright, let's wake them up and let's get going. Only punch them once. Hmm. I wonder if there's a way to know if they're gonna do the bounce or the dash, or if it's just a guessing game. Oh, Jesus. I think it's just a guessing game, really. Oh, God, I'm so dead. That's one of them dead already. Oh, come on. Come <laughs> on! If that just speeds up the process of getting getting caught off guard. One bounces, one rolls! It's not okay. I did the same this time. Oh, I killed one of them. So I'm already making some progress. Oh, that's that's really bad. Jesus, how, how am I gonna escape that? Right, both of them are bouncing, and oh, of course he hit the wall. Oh my god, and of course you roll directly after. And then you bounce, and then you bounce. Like, come on! Oh my god, you guys need to stop bouncing. Can you stop bouncing? 
Why were they constantly bouncing? Okay. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm dead. No, I landed on him. Oh, mistakes has been made. Oh my god, he died through the gas. Oh my god, there's two left. The guy that just spawned and the still dude that- Oh my god, I thought it was gonna bounce. They usually- Infected crossroads. Um, excuse me. What are you? Why are you so tough to kill? Um, why is this radiant aura here? In like, why is this? Why are you so tough to kill? I wonder what has happened over here. Can I still find this boss? The boss is still here, but it looks, uh, no. You can't battle him. That's kind of annoying, because this is kind of my money farm here. <laughs> I wonder what has happened. I mean, it's obviously something lore-based or story-based. I mean, oh Jesus, that hurt. But I wonder what. Oh, I'm so dead. Oh, this was a dumb idea. I would have died there. If I didn't know they exploded there on death, I would have died there. Jeez. Okay, I guess I didn't use my brain there. There's so many of them. They've taken up every single... F Jesus. They have taken up every single flyer. They have taken up every single flyer uh, plus more. Why did you have to make crossroads a dangerous area? This was my safe area. <laughs> the, cross the crossroads was where I went when I just wanted to take a chill. Farm some pebbles, just have a grand old time. Okay, so this dude is still here. Why might this have happened? I mean, what I've done is I've killed... I killed the boss that had a lot to do with this kind of... Inf that had a lot to do with the infectious stuff. That is not okay. I don't like... I don't like games that have a quote-unquote suicide bomber. That I don't like. Because that is so annoying. They are so annoying to deal with. Do I even dare enter? No, I don't. Like, if, if there's a boss in there, I have too many pebbles to even take the risk. Oh, go ahead. Give me the pebbles. I don't even know what's going on, to be honest. Let's get up to the city here. Why did my sound die? That's so weird. Wait a minute. There wasn't even anyone here. Oh, she's not here. Oh, that's terrifying. Oh, there you are. Okay, so she was just resting. Ah, uh, that's fine then. Ay, ay, ay. Alright, Sly, my dude. 
Pantomas, Jill. Right, I can buy mask shots and I can buy vessel fragments. Here's the thing, I am actually gonna buy every single mask shot and every single vessel fragment that he sells to me. Because if I've understood correctly, he actually has a limited <sighs> stock Bapanada. of them. So, I am definitely gonna buy all of those from him. Because it's definitely worth it. Like, it's not a question about it. So, uh, I'll do that one day. The question is just when. Um, now, the problem I have is clearly the entire crossroads has been engulfed in some kind of some kind of infestation. The problem I have with that is how do I get down to the charm later then? Because the one path that I usually took is completely blocked off. I hate the fact that I can hear the same sound as rancid eggs give away, but there's clearly no rancid eggs here. That's so annoying. Okay, so every single one of these spikes have not... Not every one have turned into this... The infestated version of themselves, so that's good to note. But the majority of them have. Oh, this is gonna be a problem, huh? Eh, it wasn't that bad. <laughs> I wanna get over here to my grubs. I wanna talk to all the... Oh my god, I have saved so many grubs. What rewards do you have? That's a lot of pebbles, my dude. That's a lot of... Oh my god, even more pebbles. So many pebbles. Oh my god. Look at the amount of pebbles. Oh, yep, I knew he could... I knew he was gonna drop me something cool in the end. Oh god, that's a lot of pebbles. I don't feel comfortable holding almost 3,000 pebbles again. Inspect. Rent. <laughs> Alright, so I know where I am. I'm in the Ancestral Mound. Now, I can't go down from the bench. Which means I actually need to go down here. I need to drop down this way. That's a lot of spikes. <laughs> And I need to enter it from here, right? It's kind of weird that the flowers has taken a yellow color as well to them. Hmm. I don't really know what I feel about this. I don't know what I feel about this at all. Let's jump up here. I know I'm gonna reset everything now, but there's a... It's a closer bench. Hello! Why did they stop and looked at me? I wanna speak to you guys. Can I do this? Another weak one. I'd suggest to try its nail within the Colosseum, though it no doubt be squashed in an instant. Alright, so I can, yeah, I can make it to her. Even this dude is... Even this dude is infected. What about in here? Okay, the house is not infected. I'm so confused. Like, I really am. This person just keeps on laughing anyway. <laughs> She's so terrifying. Hello. Alright, so... I need three more to be able to buy that nut. So I can actually only buy one charm nut. It's kind of depressing, isn't it? <laughs> but it's one more charm notch. I need three more to get that one. <laughs> then how many charm notches will I have? I already have seven. Okay, so I'll get eight from her. That's interesting. I don't need a sports room. It doesn't really do anything. Is there something in here? No. No, it isn't. Except for a lot of these. Okay, I, ca I can't break them with my dream nail either. What's up here? Have I ever been up here? I don't know if I have. No, there's pebbles up here. I've never been up here. But what is this area really for, though? You know? Hmm.
I see. I really didn't want to kill you guys though, which is the problem. I feel like that was a dumb idea. What just happened? Oh, I entered the dream world? Huh. Um, yeah, that, that might have been a dumb idea. Sure. Oh god. Why do you go downwards? It's so hard to predict downwards. Oh. Of course. <laughs> okay. Uh. Oh, that was. That was way too close. So this has always been a possibility. Um. Excuse me? You want me to do that? Um. No. No, that was definitely not it. Oh wait, I can't go down here. Isn't this where I came from? Wait! Wait, actually, isn't this where I came from? Yeah, it is. I jumped up here. I didn't walk in here though. Oh, I definitely didn't. The failed champion. Wait, what? Wait, oh, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I, okay, I, I, okay, 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 okay. I didn't know this was... What? I have no idea what just happened. <laughs> what was that? Is that like the empowered version of him? Because he hurt a lot. Like he dealt a lot of damage and it was super quick. Like all these attacks were just absolutely insane. This just makes me ask even more questions about this game. Really? Like what is this world? What is Hallownest? <laughs> I definitely want to figure that out. Um, I'm gonna be honest to say, I don't think I can beat this dude. He was way too quick to attack. I feel like I'm gonna go insane before I'm even close to beating him. I am very interested in beating the beetle dudes down here in the city of Temple in the Watcher's Spire. Because I wanna get to... I wanna get to that dreamer and I wanna figure out what she's all about. How to do that? Well, I have to beat those beetles one way or another. So, what I'm gonna do before the next episode is I'm gonna farm up as many masks as I can and as many vessels as I can to get as much of an advantage as possible to be able to beat those dudes. Getting more HP, getting more soul, I reckon that might be the way to win this. So that's gonna be the plan of what I'm gonna do between episodes. Another thing is that we still wanna figure out what is down in that black black area down there. There's also, if I remember correctly, never mind, I checked all the doors over here. Uh, we, we left we left Sot in there. We left Sot in the spider cavern, which I feel like is kind of rude. But I don't know. I, I couldn't find a way in. <laughs> so I don't know how to get in there. I can't really help him. Um, over there was just a room with some weird dudes just making weird noises. We still have the f um, fog canyon to figure out what to do in. But I need something to go through the black barriers. The howling cliff just looks like that is it, pretty much. You know, I might keep on walking to the left to see if there's anything else but I feel like that's pretty much it. So yeah, I feel like this dark area down there is the way to go. I don't know what it's called, that's why I'm just calling it the dark area. Uh, we need to go down there and we need to figure out the Watcher's Spire. Those are the two IDs, those are the- oh of course! I, I completely forgot about the Crystal Peak. Of course, we have to check the Crystal Peak out. And this is where we're gonna end today's episode. So I would like to thank you for watching through the video yours one. And don't forget to hit that like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more Hollow Knight. Because as I usually say, I absolutely love this game. And I truly hope that you all are doing the same. But for now, I would like to talk to you all in the next one. And guess what? The next one will be a lot of exploring in the Crystal Peaks. Dum dum dum.